back in the ship after a month's journey. Uh, Ashley, hey, Commander. I, I remember you. Uh, space. I'm glad space. you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Soldiers die. Ah, no, he'll be missed. Uh, he, needs, he needs to be missed. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. You earned it, soldier. You're a good soldier, Williams. You belong on the Normandy. Thanks, Commander. I appreciate that. Are you holding up okay, though? Things were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. It comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out, and you never get used to seeing dead civilians. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't have shown up. Well, you did help. We couldn't have done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Commander. I have to admit, I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. It's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. Don't disappoint me. Everyone on this ship has to do his or her part, Williams. Remember that. Understood, sir. Awesome. Um, what does this look like crap? I don't, I don't, I don't know. It might, be, it might just be because it's Mass Effect 1. Uh, hello everybody and welcome. It's been some time since I have played. Forgive me if I don't remember my controls. Um, uh, yeah. Journal. Find the beacon, done. Assignments, nothing. Awesome. Let's go to the bridge. Open. Sesame. Uh, I think. I think. All right, I am not the commanding officer. I am Commander Burt Shepard, damn it. Give me control of my ship. Hmm, I think we might be at the Citadel. Nope, don't know where we are. What's this do? Awesome, XP, love it. Who are you, no one important? Open. I'm not talking to you, Caden. Captain Anderson, am I supposed to talk to you? Go speak to Joker when you're Damn ready. Damn it! Tell him to bring the Normandy into dock. It's just up there. Sorry for messing with my sensitivity controls. Anytime you see this, or this, it's sensitivity. Gotta make sure everything is as I left it. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Proceed to 
Awesome transition game. This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue Spectre. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Well, it's the truth. Oh, oh, these are all great options. It's the truth. Saren's a threat to every human colony out there. If they don't stop him, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Amen. All right. Ah. Uh, oh. I don't remember being able to shoot on this bitch. Um. Something's in the way. Regroup. How do I put my weapons away? I don't remember. Is it four? No. Is it F? Nope. Not D. G. Fire in the hole. No. Okay, that's a grenade. That is a great. Everyone, walk away. Okay. Um, where is it? Holster. H. Duh. For H for holster. Who would have guessed? It? Okay, that blows up when Negative you holster. Contacts, Commander. Why am I walking? Toggle. Bullshit I've ever come across. You! I like you! Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. At least introduce yourself. I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? Why are you cranky? You seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. You humans are new to the Citadel, and yet the Council has granted you great favor. <sighs> Chastising rebuke, Din. Your species has always been granted many concessions. Volus territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the Citadel. <laughs> Details. We still have no real say in the decisions that affect Citadel space. All right, well, I'm leaving. Goodbye, Ambassador. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. Don't make me come back. I'm just messing. You get to live for now. Bert will allow it. Stairs. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow mm -hmm. me to introduce you. Gonna walk on over here. Boom, more XP. What the hell are you? What are you? Elcor diplomat, okay.
Okay. Damn it! Keep pulling out the weapons, man. I can't stop. I'm sorry. Oh, I thought this said executor. What the? That does say executor. Commander Shepard, I didn't expect to see you here. Did Ambassador Udina send you? Have we met before? No, but I know you well enough. I'm Executor Powell. Executor, my ass. I said Executor. It's my job. Change my mind. Someone like you arrives on the Citadel. Was there something you needed, Commander? The investigation. Hmm. Tell me about your investigation into Saren. Sorry, Commander. I don't make a habit of giving out details about ongoing investigations. Good choice. Goodbye, then. Going now. Goodbye, Commander. <laughs> Decryption. Manual. Oh God. Uh, easy. Uh, blah blah blah. If you want to read, your mother welcome to pause. I am not reading it. I don't like that music. I should have read that. I will read that with the edit. Hmm. What's over here? Nasana. Private. I don't believe the rumors. The consort would never. What do you want? Oh, Commander. You better salute. Is there something I can do for you? Relax, Private. This isn't an inspection. Right. Sorry. What can I do for you, Commander? What about this consort? What can you tell me about the Asari consort? I, uh... Well, she's an Asari who works here as... That is, she helps people with... Things. You never want to see her, did you, Fredericks? I, uh... No, I never did. Uh, I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to... Go in and talk to her. Well, where might she be? Can you at least tell me where I can find her? Sure. She's across the bridge from the embassies. Thanks, kid. Have fun. Try not to get into too much trouble. I will. Have fun, that is. Nasana? I don't have time to talk now. I'm very oh, busy. Oh, well, excuse me. I just wanted to talk. Oh, another, another creepy thing. Caden, Diplomat, Cheerian, and Asaris room I was in. That room I'm about to be out of. Alright. Let's be on the way. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me no. to be your guide. Alright. Rapid Transport Presidium. Citadel Tower. I think. I think that's where I needed to go. I don't remember. It's been a while. It's actually been like two minutes since I was told where I needed to go. <laughs> Sorry, checking a text message. Unprofessional. God damn it. Unprofessional I am. Ooh, that's a big ladder. I'm supposed to go that way. That way. Okay. Did it start me looking at the elevator or not? Garrus? Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. I, I, I was talking to that guy. And Commander he's Shepherd, here before Garrus me. McCary. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Well, you don't like Saren from the sounds of it. Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a specter. Everything he touches is classified. I can't find any hard evidence. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna talk about I'm gonna come back and talk to you. Damn it! I'm pushing buttons I shouldn't be. Is there a map button? There is. Go to the tower. And that is it. Okay, cool. Why did I get dropped off right here? Making me walk. Captain. The hearing's already started. Come on.
The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. Um, I'm not gonna stand for you, Saren. You're the one who destroyed the beacon. Then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. He's taught you well. But what can you expect? from a human. Insults. Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. Saren's hiding behind his position as a Spectre. You need to open your eyes. What we need is evidence. So far, we've seen nothing. There is still you one have outstanding a witness. issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? Nah, what's the point? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Well, how do you know Saren, Captain? Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here, but I know what he's like, and he has to be stopped. So what are we going to do about it now? What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Well, let's go talk to him. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. Well, the Captain deserves better, Ambassador. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. Captain! I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. We... Harkin's oh, probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the woods. Do we have any other leads? Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Sarah. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Balavan's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren, but his information won't come cheap. What about you and Saren, though? You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. 
Saren eliminated his target. But a lot of people died along the way. Innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience. No hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. I, well, I mean, so would I. Sometimes a thousand people must die so a million can live. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. Harkin? You don't think much of Harkin. The guy joined CSEC about 20 years ago. He's been an embarrassment to our species ever since. Roughing up suspects in custody, bribery accusations, alcohol and drug use. The embassy used to step in when he got in trouble. But I guess enough was enough. Did they abandon him? I thought this embassy was supposed to help humans. Harkin may be human, but he's also an ass. He's had uh, more I'm than his share of chances. That. If the embassy wasn't protecting him, he would have been fired 15 years ago. c -Sec is better off without him. Right. I should go. Goodbye, Captain. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Okay, so just a few things I want to go over real quick while we um, go to Cora's Den? The bar? Damn it. There go the guns. Um, when Saren was talking through the hologram, his eyes look weird to me. And I don't know if that's because he has robot parts or whatnot. But that is... That's not... It's, it's, I think... If it's only with him, I won't mind it. But if it's going to be with everyone that's a hologram, I might have an issue with it. So, we'll see. Ooh, a gentleman's club, you say? <laughs> Ashley, wait outside. Oh, not this way. It's not this way either. Alright, where's my trusty map? Upper markets, upper wards. Oh. Why would you start me facing that direction, knowing damn well I have to do a That's 180? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Bah! Oh, missed. Bah! Ah, I missed again. Bah! Get that guy. Get him! Got him. Um... Cool. I've completely forgotten how to play this game. Is that his head? Shield boot? Oh, Headshot. No scope. No scope. Perimeter secured. Are you going to shoot at us? Back off, Rex. Fist told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. See, Ashley knows what's up. There you are. Alliance military. <laughs> I could have been a Marine, you know. Instead, I joined the goddamn Citadel Security. Biggest mistake of my life. Well, maybe you can help me, Harkin. Harkin, right? I was told you could help me find someone. A Turian CSEC officer named Garrus. Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard still trying to bring Saren down, eh? 
I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? It's not my concern at this time. I just need to know where Garrus is. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor. And then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. What? Um... Not why I'm here. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Last I heard, he was going back there. Well, thank you. I'm out I'm of here now. Yeah, good. Go. Awesome. A level up. Um... Caden gets four points. a barrier and some throws. Ashley, on the other hand, can I get her shotguns? Yes! She's proficient with shotguns, everybody! Uh, now what's Bird gonna be? Um... Yeah, I gotta do that. Let's turn up the charm a bit. Add some in soldier. Now I'm also proficient in shotguns and assault training. Because why not? That seems like perfect to me. Uh, take all. Blah. Chain. Does this a gun? Ooh, I'll take the hammer. All right. Awesome. Why didn't Captain Anderson tell us he used to be a specter? Maybe it's not true. Hawkins an ass, but he's just Well, he is messing with our heads, but that's none of our concern. We have got a job to do. Up rewards, I believe. That's where I need to go. Let's see if I can... Uh, um... Yeah, med clinic. Why not? At the medical center in the wards. Okay, um... I didn't tell anyone, oh. I swear! That was smart, Doc. Now if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go! Get him. Engaging target. Now against target. Okay, hang on, hang on. I need. Oh god. Oh god, this is getting. Is he dead? He's dead now. That's it. Bag him and tag him. Is there anything over here? Okay. You, Garrus! Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. Well, it was a very nice shot, I must say. I'm I'm thoroughly impressed. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you, all of you. So tell me what happened. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Go on. Then what? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. 
Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. The Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. Do you by chance know anything else, Doctor? What else can you tell me about the Quarian? I'm not sure. Like I said, she wanted to trade information for a place to hide. She didn't... Wait a minute. Geth. Her information had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. We need to find her now. Time we paid Fist a visit. I was just there. This is there. your show, Shepard. I was I want literally to bring Saren down as just much as there you I'm coming five with minutes you. ago. Okay, you can Welcome come with me. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. Oh, I would much like to have Rex on my team, but might that's just in. me. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Oh, we're going Garrus and Ashley for now. For now. Um, you know what? Actually, I'm running a little long on this one, so I will see everyone in the next episode. Stay tuned.